Hey guys, welcome to my new video. In this video, I'm gonna show how to make this animation with After Effects. Let's get started. So guys, welcome back and in this video, I will show how to make walk cycle animation with only two frames, not any Duke Angela plugins. And first of all, select this background and character layers, move to behind and hide layers. Then let's right mouse new and create new null object and for move to anchor point center hold control and double click pen behind icon then click tool and select these all foot layers let's link to null then select this layer 3 go to solo and go to pen behind move to anchor point up click tool and select this layer 2 go to solo and again move to anchor point up Clisation tool and unsolo select this layer 1 go to solo again move to anchor point here in Clisation tool unsolo make someone for other layers select this layer 3 go to solo and move to anchor point up Clisation tool and unsolo layer 2 again move to up anchor point Clisation tool and unsolo finally select last layer go to solo and move to anchor point up okay clicization tool and unsolo right now select this null object one and press s change scale and move to up change scale more okay and in this time select this layer one this is layers for right foot let's go to solo and select this layer one let's link to layer two Select layer 2, link to layer 3. And let's unsolo. Select these left foot layers. Layer 3, 2, 1, go to solo. And select this layer 1, let's link to layer 2. Select layer 2, link to layer 3. And unsolo. So, select 3 layers. And let's press P, make new pass in keyframe. And let's select this layer 3, let's move to right and this move to left for first step pause and go to 10 keyframes for shortcut you can use hold shift press page down or click time duration right here plus 10 for go to 10 keyframes click ok and select this layer 3 let's move to left select layer 3 move to right let's see ok so, in this time, let's go to again 10 keyframes with hold shift press page down in keyboard and select first keyframes, copy pass with control C and control V. So, we have loop animation, let's see. Nice. And select keyframes, let's right mouse go to keyframe assistant and easy is or click F9. Let's animation again. Okay, this is very fast, select these all keyframes. Let's hold Alt and move to right. Okay, let's hold Alt, move to the left a little bit for more fastly. Okay, let's select this layer. In this time, let's go to middle and move to up for step animation. Let's see. Nice. And go to here, select this layer 3, go to middle and also move to up for other step animation okay that's good and select this work area for loop animation let's see nice and in this time select this layer 2 and this layer 2 press air open rotation and let's see select this layer okay in this time make rotation keyframe and go to here Let's change rotation like this. Let's see. And go to next keyframe. Select first keyframe, copy pass. And say keyframes make easy. -ease. Let's see. Nice. And select this layer 2 for right foot. And make rotation keyframe. Go to here. And change rotation like this. And go to next keyframe. Select first keyframe, copy pass, or change. 0% select rotation keyframes make easy less animation nice 
So, select this layer 1 and this layer 1 and let's press R, open rotation. Again, select this layer 1, make rotation keyframe and go to here and chain rotation like this. And go to next keyframe, chain rotation 0% and select keyframes, make easy ease. And select this layer 1, make rotation keyframe and go to here and chain rotation like this. And go to next keyframe, change 0. Say keyframes, make easy ease. Let's say animation. Okay, very nice. So let's make more keyframes for loop animation. Let's change workspace time duration 7 seconds. And right mouse and select work area. So first, select this layer 3 and select copy keyframes. Ctrl C, Ctrl V, go to next keyframe, again Ctrl V and here again paste keyframes and here and go to again last keyframe Okay, let's see Okay, that's good So, next, select this layer 2, select keyframes and copy and Go to here, Ctrl V and here, Ctrl V and here Let's say animation Okay, that's good. And let's select this layer 1, select keyframes, copy and here Ctrl V and here and here, also here. So let's see. Nice, this is our left foot. And select this layer 3 for right foot. Select these keyframes, copy and go to last keyframe. Ctrl V and again go to last keyframe, Ctrl V, again last keyframe, Ctrl V and again and again and select this layer 2 select keyframes copy and go to here control v and here control v and here and here nice and finally select this layer 1 select keyframes copy and go to here control v and here control v also here and here Okay, very easy and very fast walk cycle. So let's animation. Nice, very good. Okay, so select these foot layers, close keyframe settings, and let's enable background. Press S, change scale, move up. Again, change scale. Let's change 650. And let's press P, move to left full. Okay, make new pass in keyframe and go to last second and move right back on the image. Let's see. Okay, nice. So select last keyframe, let's move to right for more slow animation. Okay, that's good. And select this cactus layer and unhide. Press S, change scale, and move to up here. And change scale. Okay, select this cactus and let's link to background. And let's move to here. Let's see. Nice. So, select this character layer, go to FX Presses, search FX Gaussian Blur and select this Gaussian Blur, let's use for character and change blurness like this Okay, very nice So, for quality background vector, select this background layer and click this icon for enable Let's zoom to here for see difference Let's close this and okay you can see here difference for quality background layer so guys thank you for watching my video and don't forget to subscribe to channel like video and please follow me on instagram good luck